We're in Las Vegas, Nevada. DC asked me about Burroughs. I doubled down. Yeah. I'm fighting Cody Brundage. I'm about to I'm about wait, wait right now. Two million three thousand four hundred seventy-six. Oh, yeah, lost yeah. count. <laughs> oh, I didn't get that last rep. Where are we? What are we doing? We're in Las Vegas, Nevada, and we're about to watch a solar eclipse. Did you bring your glasses, or? I did not, but I'm just gonna stare straight into it and see how it goes. What's the uh, What's the plan for today? Hang out, grocery shop, and go train this evening. So. Pretty cute, it's cute, pretty simple. Whole Foods Hall, all right, we'll go over it. I got eggs, I got a little bit of dried mango, rice, banana, honey, some dark chocolate morsels, uh, some bone broth soup. I don't know what these things are, they look interesting. Peanut butter, got some water, and then uh, a couple steaks, a little bison. Couple chicken sausage packs, a little grass fed yogurt, and uh, yeah, some lemons and limes. So, looks like it's gonna be a fun week. I'm surprised, there's only like two steaks in there, man. Oh, there's three, relax. All right. Well, I'm cutting weight, so two, I can't have three, seven six. steaks this week, Ronan. I have to limit it, I have to cut it down. I'm trying to decide what to do with these ping pong balls. If I bend it, if I bend it. <laughs> <laughs> you got the keys around it? I got it. The most I ever did was like a little less than that. Yeah. Alright, Tony, what are we doing this evening? Washing my mouth guard out. And we're gonna roll and hit some pads and sauna start the weight cut. What's kind of the point of this workout today? Uh, just keep the body moving and start the weight cut week off right. Nothing special, work on some basic techniques and game plan, but more about just staying sharp and loose. Kind of did a little uh, run through, um, get a sweat going. My first workout in Vegas, and uh, yeah, I'm feeling good, feeling sharp. Always good to get that first blow in and first uh, sweat broken. And you know, I think I'm just gonna keep feeling better and better uh, as the week continues. I'm fighting Cody Brundage. You know, it's a good matchup. He's the first wrestler that I fought, so you know he has some good skills. Um, obviously, different than some of the other guys that fought. He has some unorthodox stuff, but I think that uh, you know I'm prepared for all of that. Uh, like I said, put a hard training camp in, and um, I have great training partners and great coaches and people to learn from and listen to. So you know, I'm just excited to go out there and be free and do my thing. All right, Joseph, what do you got for breakfast today? Just some eggs and potatoes, keeping it simple. Cut down the amount of calories you're intaking right now, too. Yeah, starting to cut it down, but uh, I still feel good. It's water loading, so I'm still drinking quite a bit of water um, every day, but yeah, a little less, a little less food, and just, you know, obviously careful about what I'm eating. How are you guys feeling about it? Is there anybody you're looking forward to possibly running into, or what is, like, your thoughts on this? I wouldn't say there's anybody that I'm looking forward to running into. I got a lot of friends already, so I'm <laughs> not looking to make any new friends. But, uh, yeah, I think, you know, being uh, part of the, the event, you can already tell the energy is super high. This whole week's going to be great. And, 
yeah, you know, I'm just grateful to be here and grateful that I'm able to participate and you know, be a part of it. So it's going to be pretty, pretty fun for sure. Pretty cool. Unless, Sorry. Chris, unless Sorry, Chris Pratt's here. here. Unless Chris Pratt's here, then yeah, then we, I can make a friend. That's true. <laughs> We're already kind of boys. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we talk. We've talked before. <laughs> this dude's always posing. <laughs> what is that? That's, that's, that's not real. That's not. You're not comfortable. I'm so comfortable. <laughs> that was just an exact pose at the PI. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He, just, he was like, "Don't stop what you're doing." And I was like, "This is what I'm doing." I did see your April Fool's video, and I didn't believe no, you that did you were not. going vegan. Oh I did, and I was like, "Wow, whatever this doc is that he watched is really powerful." <laughs> so good. I like that honey you got, the viscosity is top notch. Yeah, that's one of my favorite honeys I've ever had. Viscosity? Ronan's learned a lot of new things today. He learned the word viscosity. He learned the word erroneous. Taking him to school. What does erroneous mean, Tony? It means with error. Yeah. Exactly, it's in the word. Give me more peanut butter. DC asked me about burrows. I doubled down. This is what he led with. I'm the one that brought it up. I should have said, I know you're the one that brought it up but I like you. <laughs> what I said was, I'm aware you asked the question, but he chose to answer it the way he chose to answer it. What I said was, you can get it too. <laughs> what I said was, five time pro bowlers can get knocked out too, Brandon. You know, I went uh, to the optometrist, the ophthalmologist before um, to get my eyes checked. I have 20-20, yeah, it's perfect. My vision got better. Yeah, I just willed it. I stopped wearing glasses. And uh, I just decided that my eyes, I was like, you're gonna figure it out. Most people's eyes deteriorate, mine reteriorate. Just proves with enough willpower you can do anything. Perception's reality. Just gonna get a sweat in, same as usual. So, mess around, lose some weight, that's about it. How's Nothing your weight right now? I'm about 12 over, 12, 13, 14, right in there. But, uh, very hydrated and feeling good. You just asked him about it. Yeah, does that sound good? Have you been, been working on it? Yeah, yeah. Let's throw, let's throw puss off. How's it coming? Great. <laughs> a lot of technique. No, I heard him say that. He's got a good one. I heard him say Always has, always has. Since, yeah, yeah, no, he's good. Since he was young, yeah. he had to, always had a good one. Real flat foot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Kind, of, kind of born with it. Fred Flintstone. Marco Huas, first one ever to like do a foot stomp. Oh. It was a big deal. I feel like you could get it right, like maybe with your heel or something. Oh yeah. But like you don't feel it, you're gonna have to like yeah. you really have to break bones to Yeah. It's definitely like not as bad as getting hit in the face. Or kicked in the cap. That's gonna be awesome. We had heard that when I was And if we look rather closely, we see the rare bone nickel in its natural habitat. 